Nicki Minaj audio where it's like, are you happy to be in Paris? Mm -hmm. She's like, we. Oui. <laughs> it's like really pretty. Hear about this? Maybe I'll go. It's closed today, but maybe I'll find time to go tomorrow. Anyways, hello. <laughs> Haven't got to talk too much. Um, so I'm in Paris. Um, if you don't know, I am graduating college. So this is my graduation gift, which we didn't even really plan to come here. I came here by myself last year, but Paris had the cheapest round trip tickets. So we're here for a few days. We're gonna pop over to London and then we're gonna go to Edinburgh too in Scotland. So it's a fun time. But the first day we really just walked around until we could check into our hotel and then napped. Went to dinner, walked around some more. But today we got up, got breakfast. My parents are with me. I don't know if I said that. And I sent them to Versailles because I've already done Versailles. And I really just, I don't know, I just wasn't in the mood. It's gorgeous. I would totally recommend going to see it, but I just didn't feel like doing it a second time. Um, so I just kind of wanted to walk around and like do my own thing. Really, I just wanted to have time by myself because I don't know. I just feel like, I feel like Paris is a really nice city to solo travel. So if you're looking for one, I would recommend. Um, but I did pop into this little bookstore that's super famous. It's Shakespeare and Company. I love it. They were renovating some of it, which I read this thing that said that they were renovating it based off of archives that they found from like the 60s. Uh, and they're adding some like some type of like a glass roof or something like that. I don't know. It was so cute and there was like a little cafe next door. So I kind of want to go back and try out the cafe. It's right across from Notre Dame. Like you can see Notre Dame from the bookstore, which is really cool. And they had this little like upstairs just for sitting down and reading. How lovely. And there was a piano in there and like several people came in and sat down and started playing at the piano. I actually started all as well. I read like the first six pages of it just hanging out there. But look what I got, it's so cute. I have n no room left in my suitcase. I picked something the flattest as possible. Look how cute this little tote bag is. Ah, 
I wanted a cream one, but the navy will do. Let me go to look. Do I look Parisian? If I don't, don't tell me. We've already run into um, quite a few embarrassing like American moments, so. Um, my mom tried to tell a waiter, thank you, and she said, bonjour. And I was like, try again. But that's okay. All right, this is what I was talking about though. It's the BN, BNF, France's public library. That's so pretty. But I have a little secret planned for the last day that we're here. And my parents don't know what it is. But tonight, we have tickets for a Moulin Rouge show, which I definitely did not do that when I was here by myself. But my mom really wanted to do it. So we're going to that. I really don't know what to expect. The only thing that I've heard is that it's like a burlesque show, but it's really tastefully done. So, I know we have to dress nice for it. They said they won't let us in if we're wearing tennis shoes. So I brought my little Bratz heels. I love them. Until then, I'm gonna figure out what museum I wanna go to and probably lunch. I'm hungry. Okay, so I'm booking tickets for Musée de Lancerie. You know, maybe one day my French accent will be good, but uh, what is 16? What is 16 o'clock? I need to get better at military time, but I don't think that I ever will be. 15, 16. Okay, perfect. That's in like 15 minutes. Perf. And I'll go walk around there for like an hour. Okay, so it says that I have like up until 30 minutes after I booked my ticket to enter. What if I go early? Mm, I'm just gonna book it for now. You know what? That's really not bad. It's only like 12 euros. Um, okay, let's go. Oh my gosh, should I use my little tote bag instead of my purse? I have to, I'm going to. Y'all, I'm not gonna lie. I'm feeling very French right now. I also can't move my arms very much but that's okay. Okay, don't want to be late. a good day so on my way back i found this little cafe that i was like okay cool i'll just go hang out there get a coffee get a snack whatever till my parents are back from versailles um accidentally stumbled upon a cute little christmas market it was adorable so yeah so instead i just got some like mulled wine and and a couple macaroons and then just walked around and looked at the christmas markets it was so cute but now I've got to go grab them and get ready and stuff. And then we're going to Moulin Rouge. And all the outfits were so good. 
I was definitely nodding off on the metro here though. <laughs> I definitely have to go to sleep immediately. I think tomorrow's a museum day, so. Pit check. Looks like a little French girl. <laughs> <laughs> um, opera house. Going to the opera house. Then lunch. And then walk around the cute little area. And then dinner. Okay, that was incredible. Hello. I don't know how I didn't know about that the last time I was here, but okay, that was gorgeous. Um, I'm gonna take a nap before dinner because I am still so jet lagged. Okay, so change of plans. This is what, the third full day that we've been here? We're tired. <laughs> but honestly, we've done quite a bit since we've been here. I'm just staying in, gonna have a chill rest of the night, do a little face mask, and um, be like refreshed for tomorrow, which I think we're gonna check out some Christmas markets. Um, and then we take the train tomorrow, or not tomorrow, the next day to go to London, which I'm really excited for. I've never been here before. So we're gonna be lazy tonight. Are you still watching the like Wednesday Adams thing? Yeah. Is it good? I got this like Tatcha moisturizer. I got it as like a present for my birthday from Ulta and I really like it. It smells so good. But yeah, it was like, it's like a little sample. So it was like the perfect size for like to bring for traveling. Cute. I'm not gonna lie, that was actually really helpful. <laughs> Good morning. So my dad's on a coffee run for us, but after we're going to brunch at Bouvette's, which is literally the best croque monsieur I've ever had, ever. Uh, I came here last time off of like a recommendation from a friend. So good. So we're gonna do that. Oh my gosh. And then there's like this little area that Bouvette's is in, which I didn't realize last time. So cute. So hopefully we're gonna walk around that. I forgot what it was called though, so I'll figure it out. So we're going to London tomorrow and I couldn't bring 
my like curling and flat iron because it like it messes up with the plugs i don't know so i'm gonna try the leggings heatless curl thing <laughs> the execution is looking rough it looked tight on her head so i don't really know what else to do see <laughs> what expectations are low It wouldn't really work very well. Oh. Mesdames, Mesdemoiselles, Messieurs, le commandant et son équipage vous souhaitent la bienvenue à bord. It's been fun, it's been real fun.